Yo, what's up everyone, it's your name, and welcome to the channel. Today we're diving deep into the world of ethical hacking and cybersecurity. This isn't about those Hollywood hacker stereotypes, this is about understanding how to protect networks the right way. We're talking about the tools, the techniques, and the mindset you need to become a force for good in the digital world. So buckle up, because we're about to explore the fascinating world of ethical hacking and how it's shaping a safer internet for everyone. Let's get started. All right, before we get into the nitty gritty of hacking, let's take a step back. Imagine the digital world as a massive interconnected network built on a foundation of ones and zeros. Everything from your online banking to your social media, even this video you're watching, it's all just data flowing through this intricate web. And just like in the physical world, security is paramount. Cybersecurity is the guardian of this digital realm. It's about protecting your data, your identity, and the systems we rely on every single day. Think about it, every time you log in, make a purchase, or share information online, you're trusting that the systems behind it are secure. That's where cybersecurity comes in, building those digital walls and fortifying those virtual gates. But here's the catch. Technology is constantly evolving, and with it, the threats are becoming more sophisticated. It's a constant game of cat and mouse, with cybersecurity professionals working tirelessly to stay one step ahead. So, whether you're a tech enthusiast or just starting to explore the digital landscape, understanding the basics of cybersecurity is crucial for everyone. Now let's talk about hacking. You see, just because you understand how something works doesn't give you the right to exploit it. Think of it like a car. You might be a gearhead who can take an engine apart and put it back together, but that doesn't mean you can hotwire your neighbor's car and take it for a joyride. In the digital world, unauthorized access is a crime, plain and simple, regardless of your intentions. Remember those courtroom scenes in movies? Well, they're not too far from reality. Illegal hacking can lead to serious consequences, from hefty fines to actual jail time. We've seen it happen time and time again, individuals getting caught up in activities they thought were harmless pranks only to face the full force of the law. So, before you even think about testing your skills on a system that's not yours, Remember the potential consequences. It's just not worth it. Now let's talk about the good guys. Ethical hackers. These are the cybersecurity experts who use their knowledge for good, working within legal boundaries to make the digital world a safer place. Think of them as digital detectives, using their skills to identify vulnerabilities before the bad guys can exploit them. Ethical hackers are like the quality assurance team of the Internet, constantly testing, probing, and trying to break things in a controlled environment. Their goal? To find those weak points, those cracks in the system, and report them so they can be fixed before any real damage is done. They're the ones working behind the scenes, collaborating with organizations, governments, and businesses to strengthen their defenses against cyber attacks. It's all about staying one step ahead, anticipating threats, and ensuring that our digital lives are protected. So when we talk about ethical hacking, remember, it's about using your knowledge responsibly, ethically, and always, always within the bounds of the law. Let's dive into a specific area of ethical hacking Wi-Fi penetration testing. Think of your Wi-Fi network like your home. You've got doors, windows, maybe even a secret back entrance. Each of these is a potential entry point, and just like you'd check your locks and secure your windows, Ethical hackers test the vulnerabilities of your Wi-Fi network. They use specialized tools and techniques to try and gain unauthorized access, simulating real-world attack scenarios. This helps them identify weaknesses in your passwords, router configurations, and overall network security. It's like having a security expert case your house, pointing out potential weak points before a burglar can find them. The goal is to find those vulnerabilities before the bad guys do giving you a chance to strengthen your defenses and protect your data. So, whether you're a business owner with a large network or just someone who wants to secure their home Wi-Fi, penetration testing is a crucial step in maintaining a strong security posture. Now let's talk about some common cybersecurity threats and ethical hacking techniques used to combat them. First up, password cracking. We've all been guilty of using weak or easily guessable passwords at some point. Ethical hackers use techniques like brute force attacks and dictionary attacks to test the strength of your passwords, highlighting the importance of strong, unique passwords for all your accounts. Next, deauthentication attacks. 
ever been kicked off a Wi-Fi network unexpectedly? That could be a de-authentication attack disrupting your connection to the network. Ethical hackers use this technique to test the resilience of your network against such attacks. Then there's the evil twin attack. Imagine connecting to a Wi-Fi network that you think is legitimate, only to find out it's a rogue access point set up by an attacker. Ethical hackers simulate these attacks to expose vulnerabilities in your network's ability to identify and prevent unauthorized access points. Finally, packet sniffing. Think of it like eavesdropping on a conversation, but instead of words, it's data packets traveling across the network. Ethical hackers use packet sniffing tools to analyze network traffic, identifying potential security loopholes and vulnerabilities. In this chapter, we're diving into the toolkit of an ethical hacker, and specifically, how to utilize Termux to enhance your ethical hacking capabilities. Termux provides a powerful Linux environment on your Android device, making it a portable platform for ethical hacking. Essential tools include air cracking for Wi-Fi security assessment, Reaver for cracking WPS pins, and Fern Wi-Fi Cracker for testing Wi-Fi security. Wi-Fi automates Wi-Fi penetration tests, and Nmap is a versatile tool for network exploration and vulnerability discovery. Lastly, TCP Dump captures and analyzes network traffic in real time. Ready to start your ethical hacking journey? Here are some beginner tips. Build a strong foundation. Learn networking basics, data flow, and security concepts. This is your compass. Set up a safe testing environment. Use virtual machines or labs. Avoid live systems. Join ethical hacking communities. Platforms like Hack the Box and Try Hack Me. Stay updated on trends. Cybersecurity evolves constantly. Prioritize ethics and legality. Always get proper authorization. Ethical hacking makes the digital world safer. Respect boundaries and the law. Let's take a moment to appreciate the crucial role ethical hackers play in our increasingly digital world. These individuals are the unsung heroes of cybersecurity working tirelessly behind the scenes to protect our data, our privacy, and our digital lives. Every time you make an online purchase, access your bank account, or even just browse the web, you're benefiting from the work of ethical hackers. They're the ones who help ensure that websites are secure, transactions are encrypted, and our personal information is protected from malicious actors. They work with organizations to identify vulnerabilities, strengthen their defenses, and prevent cyber attacks before they can occur. They're constantly pushing the boundaries, thinking like attackers to anticipate threats and develop countermeasures, but their role goes beyond just technical expertise. Ethical hackers also play a vital role in educating the public about online safety, raising awareness about potential threats, and empowering individuals to protect themselves in the digital world. They're advocates for responsible technology use, promoting best practices, and encouraging a culture of cybersecurity awareness. As we've explored throughout this journey, ethical hacking is not about exploiting vulnerabilities for personal gain. It's about using knowledge and skills responsibly to make the digital world a safer place for everyone. It's about understanding the systems we rely on, identifying their weaknesses, and working to strengthen them against potential threats. By embracing ethical hacking principles, we can create a more secure online environment where individuals and organizations can thrive without fear of cyber attacks. It's about fostering a culture of responsibility, ensuring that technology is used for good, and protecting the digital realm for future generations. So, whether you're considering a career in cybersecurity, interested in learning more about ethical hacking, or simply want to be more aware of online threats, remember this. Knowledge is power, and when used responsibly, it can be a powerful force for good in our increasingly interconnected world. That's it for today's deep dive into the world of ethical hacking and cybersecurity. I hope this video has given you a better understanding of this fascinating field and the crucial role ethical hackers play in keeping us safe online. If you're interested in learning more, be sure to check out the resources in the description below. Remember, the digital world is constantly evolving, and so are the threats we face. By staying informed, practicing good cybersecurity hygiene, and supporting the work of ethical hackers, we can all contribute to a safer and more secure online experience for everyone. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace!